Grace Kitchens presents Creative Cooking. In this Easter series, we invite you to enjoy some interesting meal ideas for the Lenten season. And now, here's today's host. Welcome to the show. Many people think that tofu is not appetizing and it's very hard to cook. Today we are going to take the mystery out of tofu. Joining us for the program is Mrs. Paulette Roden and her son, Chef Warren Roden. Welcome to the program. Thanks for having us, Liz. It's always a pleasure to be with yeah. you on the Grace We are so delighted to have you. you know? Mrs. Roden, tell us a little about tofu, a little about its origin. Tofu actually was a um, protein staple of many of the Asiatic nations for over 2,000 years. Taofu is made from the soya bean curds. Mm -hmm. It is, the curds is usually put under heavy weight and to extract all the water and it becomes like a cheese. Guide us as to some of the dishes. You could slightly bake it mm -hmm. and put it on a salad and it'd be the substitute for chicken. Mm -hmm. um, on an entree, it's your meat substitute, as in you could sweet, do sweet and sour, Tofu, which is a nice dish, mm -hmm. you know, if you like chicken and stuff. You can do tofu, Mediterranean. Mm -hmm. You can blend it with um, non-fat yogurt and pineapple, and it's a beautiful dessert. Wow. Chef Warren, you're going to do food prep for us very quickly. Before you do the food prep, oh, tell us a little about yourself. Where were you trained? Well, I was trained at George Brown College in Toronto, Canada for four years. Um, I've also worked for the Ritz Carlton Hotel chain for mm -hmm. about three years, and now I'm currently at the Mandarin Oriental Hotel, which both are nice. five star, five diamond Excellent. resorts. Excellent. What are you cooking uh -huh. for us, son? Um, I'm making my Buddhist delight. It's um, stuffed tofu with a vegetarian stack. Hello. Um, I'm here to show you the Buddhist delight. First you take your onions, you heat your saute pan and add your olive oil. Take your onions, start sweating your onions, tomatoes, then you add your callaloo. You saute this down. A little salt and pepper to taste. Just a little water to steam it down. Now I'm gonna let this steam for a little bit while I make the sauce. You add just a little bit of olive oil, not too much. You sweat your onions down. You add your tomatoes. Your coconut milk. A teaspoon of thyme. And to add a little spice to it, some scotch bonnet pepper. You bring this to a boil and let it simmer. I have the tofu marinating in soya sauce, water and black pepper. Take one block, which is, this is a half a block. You cut it in half, cut it in the center. You got two squares. Then you just cut on a bias. There, you have your triangles. Now with the tofu triangles, if you have a small paring knife, you go dead in the center. Just make a little slit right down. You open it up. There, you have your pocket for your stuffing. Take the tip of your spoon, stuff it all the way in. This is a mixture of cornstarch and flour. It's to bread the tofu. It's actually a light, nice way of breading. Mm -hmm. 
Now, moving on to our vegetable stack. We have marinated the peppers, zucchini, and portobello and eggplant in olive oil, salt, and pepper. To top it off, a little sauce on top. This really is very creative. The well, shapes and the forms, the design you have created, a triangle there, really says much for plating. Yes. You know? um, this is one of our favorite dishes um, for banquets and at the restaurant. Some people come in and order special mm -hmm. and they want it totally vegan. So, and you know everybody's on this you know, no carb mm -hmm. diet. Or so, low carb. Or low either. carb. Yes. Mm -hmm. So this is a perfect dish for them. Thank you very much. talking about TVP or textured vegetable protein. Joining me again is Mrs. Paulette Roden. Hi Mrs. Roden. Hi Maisie. I know you're an expert on the range of vegetarian um, products. We get a number of calls Mrs. Roden from our, our, our consumers and they want us to share with them how to prepare these food items. We have here approximately a cup. This right? is the veggie mints mm -hmm. and this is the chunks. This is the unseasoned chunks because if they are seasoned, which is just simply a little bit of tau, um, soya sauce and maybe a little garlic or a salt added, and so, right. color, it becomes as dark as this. You take this cup of TVP chunks, wash it off like you would wash rice, and add twice the amount of water to the product. What I recommend is that you season the water by adding a little bit of pimento and maybe a, a sprig of thyme because you know the Jamaican thyme is very, very nice. Yes. And you can put a little salt and black pepper. When you come back, you will have almost Double. three to four times oh. the quantity. Volume. You can also use the mince in many dishes. The mince, you reconstitute it same way, season it. What you do, you chop like a little onion, sweet pepper, tomatoes, and you saute that and add the soaked mince. Mm -hmm. And it's just as if you were making your own um, meat uh, mince. Mm -hmm. It becomes grounded, grounded beef. beef. Mm -hmm. It would be the same way. When you do the mince, you can make beautiful pizzas. You just mm -hmm. use a Syrian pita bread. Mm -hmm. You put a little bit of um, tomato ketchup. Mm -hmm. You sprinkle on your veggie, cooked veggie mince, right. and then you put your various cheese. Thanks again for sharing with us, Mrs. It was Rodney. a pleasure being here. It's always amazing. a pleasure working with you. Well, that's our show for today. Remember that this and other recipes are available for you. Just phone us, write us, or email us at Grace Kitchens, and we'll be too happy to send them to you. Till next time, thanks for watching. We hope you enjoyed today's creative cooking show, a great tasting meal for the Lenten season. Join us again next Monday morning at 7.35 on Smile Jamaica It's Morning Time for Creative Cooking.